always look for a way to simplify a problem like this. To simplify this one, we can add an extension to one of our parallel lines here, and that creates a triangle in this bottom corner. And if we look at this part of the angle, which is a straight line, that's going to be 180 degrees. And that then tells us the whole thing is 240, part of it's 180. We know that this inside corner of the triangle is going to be 60 degrees. And if that's the case, our angles in the triangle need to add up to 180 degrees. We've got 60 plus 25. We've got 85 degrees already. So this angle in here we know is going to be 95 degrees. Sorry, it's a bit messy. And now we've got this angle here and this angle here are going to be complementary angles. So 95 plus something has to add up for a straight line, has to add up to 180 degrees again. So in that case, 95 plus 85 is going to give us this angle here. And these two angles are corresponding angles. They're the same on parallel lines with an intersection. So X is the same as this, X is 85 degrees.